The Association of Arctic Expedition Cruise Operators, AICO, welcomes you to the Arctic. We kindly ask you to pay attention now as we cover some basic guidelines to ensure respectful, environmentally friendly and safe expedition cruising. Always pay attention to and follow the instructions given by your expedition leader or guide. Leave no lasting signs of your visit. You must of course not leave anything, including any litter, behind. Do not engrave on rocks or buildings, and do not build cairns, rearrange stones, or in any other way leave visible signs of your visit. We also ask you to watch where you set foot in order to protect the flora and vegetation and avoid path making. Avoid stepping on flowers or plant beds if at all possible. In some parts of the Arctic, flora is protected by law, in others not. AICO regards all flora as protected and asks you to not pick flowers or other plants. We encourage you to leave the Arctic as it is. Do not take anything with you and do not attempt to touch or rearrange objects. They might be cultural remains. In addition, we ask you to leave stones, bones, antlers, driftwood and other items where they are. AICO regards all fauna in the Arctic as protected and will avoid disturbing animals and birds as far as possible. If close to animals and nesting birds, avoid making loud noises and keep conversation low and calm. You will be instructed by your leader. Please help us preserve the wildlife by following the instructions. AICO controls maximum group sizes when making landings and excursions and also minimum distances to various wildlife. Travel in Arctic areas may involve various risks. We would like to focus on some very important safety precautions. Use the sailor's grip when embarking and disembarking the boat. When in a boat, take a seat at the designated place and always remain seated during the trip. Be sure to always have your life vests on properly. Secure equipment and belongings to avoid losing items overboard. One passenger enters and leaves the boat at a time. There should never be more than one passenger standing at a time while embarking or disembarking. Staff members will be carrying firearms and other bear deterrents in areas where polar bears could be encountered. The staff is trained in firearm handling, but firearms can be dangerous. Do not make any attempt to touch or hold firearms. In many Arctic towns and settlements there will be a significant number of Arctic dogs. They are working dogs and not pet animals they can be dangerous to strangers. Therefore, never approach or attempt to pet or feed Arctic dogs without permission and supervision from the dog handler. Rabies has been detected in Arctic regions. Some animals, such as the Arctic fox, Arctic dogs and Arctic wolves, are potential carriers of rabies. Never touch live or dead wild animals. In areas with polar bears, the bears can be encountered anywhere, anytime. Although polar bears normally will try to avoid encounters with humans, they are potentially extremely dangerous to humans. We will make every effort to ensure both your and the animal's safety, and therefore the following rules are non-negotiable. Never stray from your group and the leaders carrying equipment to protect you. If you catch sight of polar bears, stay calm and immediately inform your guide. Never approach them. Never leave food anywhere in an attempt to lure polar bears. And as always, follow your leader's instruction. Tourism is a great way of learning about, promoting and creating tolerance between people of different backgrounds and cultures. When visiting foreign countries and cultures, guests may find things very different from home. 
It is important not to judge other cultures based on one's own sense of reality, norms and values. But try to understand that cultures are qualitatively different. Cairns may be signposts. Do not alter them. Tourism in Arctic regions is growing rapidly. Anyone involved needs to be cognizant to the economic, social and cultural impact the growing tourism may have on local communities. Respect people's privacy. Keep a good distance from private houses and never glance or photograph through private windows. For a small and sometimes isolated town or settlement in the Arctic, the call of a cruise ship is often a welcome and happy event. Remember to talk to and not about people you meet and work against prejudiced attitudes. Do not visit graveyards or other areas of religious or cultural significance without permission. Ask before you photograph. A hesitation means no. You are encouraged to buy local souvenirs and products, but be aware of the legalities of importing and transporting purchases into other countries. Also, never barter or import banned substances to a community. Finally, let's quickly recap the visitor's guidelines. Leave no lasting signs of your visit. Do not pick flowers. Do not take anything with you. Do not disturb animals and birds. Leave cultural remains alone. Be sure to always have your life vests on properly. One passenger enters and leaves the boat at a time. Use the sailor's grip when embarking and disembarking the boat. Take a seat at the designated place. Always remain seated. There should never be more than one passenger standing at a time while embarking or disembarking. Secure equipment and belongings to avoid losing items overboard. Never approach or attempt to pet Arctic dogs without permission and supervision from the dog owner or handler. Rabies has been detected in Arctic regions. Therefore, never touch live or dead wild animals. Never stray from your group and the leaders carrying equipment to protect you. If you catch sight of polar bears, stay calm and immediately inform your guide. Never approach a bear if you catch sight of it. Never leave food anywhere in an attempt to lure polar bears. Follow your leader's instruction. And finally, work against prejudiced attitudes. Respect privacy. Keep a good distance from private houses and never glance or photograph through private windows. Talk to and not about people you meet. Do not visit graveyards or other areas of religious or cultural significance without permission. Ask before you photograph. A hesitation means no. Cairns may be signposts. Do not alter them. Never barter or import banned substances to a community. You are encouraged to buy local souvenirs and products, but be aware of the legalities of importing or transporting purchases into other countries. Thank you for helping us conduct respectful, environmentally friendly and safe tourism in the Arctic. Have a wonderful Arctic journey.